Hey guys, hello, hello, good evening. Good evening, Tisha. Uh, good evening, Connie. Thank you for reporting to the class. Hello, uh, Guillermo. Hello, hello. Welcome. Uh, let's see in Erika uh, Jamilia. Hello, Erika. Oh, okay. Uh, hello, good evening, teacher. Good evening, Erika. Great greeting you. Okay, Guillermo says, hello, teacher. I am in a meeting. Sorry for, I can participate in the class today. Okay, no problem, uh, Guillermo. If it's about job, it's it's all right. Don't worry. Okay, um, we are four. Four in the class, it's already eight. How was uh, the second day of the week? Boys, girls, how was the second day of the week? Normal day at work, at your studies? Saturday. Uh -huh, okay. But how was how was the day? Uh, BC, you had a busy day. You have, I don't know, a hectic. Hectic is like in a hurry in a hurry, in your job, in your studies, in your activities. Okay, uh, let's see. Yes, Connie? In my house, teacher. Ah, you didn't work today. Mm -hmm. Don't work today. Okay, all right, perfect. That's great that you were at home. Oscar, hello, Oscar. I see you already online. Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. How is it going? Great. How is it going? It's like, how are you guys? How is it going? Good? Okay, all right. Um, welcome, welcome to class uh, number, you remember the number uh, of the class? What number do we have in the class? This is the second week. Remember what number of class? Seven class. Uh, number seven. Mm, one less. One less. Mm -hmm. One number six. less. Six. Correct. It's class number six. Anna Christina. Hello, Anna. How is it going? Good. Ah, uh, okay. Check the microphone because I can't hear you. Guys, can you hear uh, Anna Christina? Can you hear Anna? Yes or no? Can you? Can you hear Anna? You can listen to us, okay? But we can't listen to you. Maybe there is an issue with the microphone, but you can check, don't worry. Okay, guys, uh, what is the date? The day today? What is the date? What is the date? Someone can tell me the date that we have today. Thursday. Thursday. Tuesday. Thursday. October 1st. All right. Tuesday. October 3rd. Yeah, correct. October 3rd. Correct. October 3rd, 2023. That is the day. Pretty good. Okay. Let's see. Let's open class number six. Um, we have new material that we are going to cover. We are going to study. Okay. Let's go directly to this class. You know the indications, all right? We don't read them every day, but if you have a camera, use it, use your camera. Uh, connect punctually, be attentive in the class. Um, no distractions, please. Don't use the phone, the TV, or the radio. You can check that in another moment. And your participation, remember, 
the more you participate, the class is better, better, better. Okay, let's advance with this. All right, if you have questions, you can ask. Ask your questions and your doubts in the four areas that we practice, speaking, listening, grammar, and practice. Okay, the tools, we use the tools in the middle of the class. Okay, Connie, Connie, Connie. Attentive, Connie. What is today's topic? No, it's... Quantitative huh? desde arriba? Yeah, from uh, of the top. Yeah, the title okay. of the top. Okay. Quant quantifiers. Quantifier. Quantifier. Quantifier to serve how much or how many. A few people, a lot of problem. Problem. Okay, all right, very good. Erica, can you read the definition about quantifiers as well, please? Okay. We, we use. We use quant uh, quantifier to say how much or how many a few people uh, a lot of problems. Okay, guys, tell me, what are the words that appear in purple. All the words in purple. Can you read them? The first how one is much? how much. Oh. What is what is oh. how much in in Spanish? What is how much? Mucho tiempo. Hace mucho. Uh, no, hace Cuanto. mucho is how Cuanto. long. Cuánto. Cuánto. Yes. Uh, how much how much money you have in the bank? Uh, cuánto. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. How much money you have in the bank? No money? Yes. Nothing. Learn to save no, money. money. Learn to save it. Aprenda a ahorrar. Uh -huh. Learn to save money. Okay. How much is cuánto? Correct. The next word in purple. Mm -hmm. how, many, how many? How many? How many? How many? How Correct, yes. Uh, example uh, of a question with how many? Question example, please. Quantas? In English, in English. How many, in English. How many people? How many people? Okay. How many uh, how many people that is correct? Uh -huh. How many brothers do you have? You have brothers? How many brothers do you have, guys? Answer, please. Answer the question. How many brothers? Uh, how many brothers? Brothers, brothers do you have? I have two brothers in my case. Uh, Jose has two brothers. All right. Uh, Gilbert, how many brothers do you have in your family? Uh, I have uh, four brothers in my okay. family. Okay, four brothers in your family. Okay, very good. Uh, let's see, Anna Cristina, how many how many children do you have? Children. Use the chat. If your microphone is not working, use the chat. There is an option. You can activate the chat and you type. Your answer. Mercedes, how many uh, children do you have, Mercedes? I don't have children. You don't. Okay, that is a correct, a correct answer. If you don't have, you don't have. Susana, how many, uh, let's see, how many uh, brothers or sisters do you have? I had one sister. One sister. Brothers? Yes. No. No. All right. Okay. Pretty good. Okay. See how much is for uncountable and how many for count. We are going to check in a moment. The next word in purple is. The next word in a purple. Few. A few. A few. What is a few? Pocos. Oh. Unos. Unos pocos. A few. I just have a few. 
a few problems. Money, house, and four more. I just have a few problems, for example. Or you can say the other the other word in purple. A lot of. A lot of. Correct. A lot of problems. Okay, in this example. Okay, all the words in purple are quantifier. Quantifiers. Yes. We are going to check how many is for countable nouns. For countable nouns. Can you give examples uh, for countable nouns that you know? What are countable nouns? Can you give examples? People. Repeat it, please. Uh huh. Repeat it. The natural numbers. Um, natural natural numbers. Mm, not really. Countable nouns are things that you can say uh, to computers, computers, books, etc. Those are countable nouns. But do you Objects. know? Objects, yes. Objects. Objects that you can count, that you can use. Numbers, yes, correct. Examples, what are countable nouns? We have? Tomatoes. 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 Yes. Computers. Computers. Phones. Phones. Boxes. 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 Huh? House. Houses. Houses. What else is countable? Countable means that you can say one, two, three, four, five, six. What else? What else is countable in your opinion? Mm -hmm. How about the objects? objects. Mention objects. the objects. Is, many. Uh, many. Many is a quantifier. How many? This is the yeah. quantifier, but examples for countable, for example, let's see, I don't know. Apples. Apples, yes. Apples are countable, correct. Apples are countable. Car. Excuse me. Excuse me? Cars. Cars, yes. Cars are countable. People. People are countable. That's right. Uh -huh. Class, okay. Classmates, correct. Okay, all those are countable nouns. Things that you can say one, two, three, four, five, etc. All right, I got it. Yes, how many? Easy, right? How many sisters, yes. books, etc. Let's see. And for how much we have? Mm -hmm. Countable. That is the opposite. Objects that you can't use numbers with. For example, uncountable. That is the opposite from countable things. Water. Water. Ah, okay, I have, yeah, I have some water in this bottle. <laughs> water is uncountable. That's right. Yes. Ooh. Uh -huh. Sugar. Morning. Sugar is uncountable, correct. Money, money as as the word, yes. But what about dollars? Are dollars countable dollars, or dollars. uncountable? A dollar. <laughs> a dollar? But what is a dollar? Countable or uncountable? Countable. It's countable. countable, yes. But money, money in the general idea is uncountable. That's why... I made you the question. Hey guys, how, how much money? How much? Because it's uncountable. What else is uncountable? Let's see the chat. Yeah, Christ, uh, Anna Christina, we are talking about uncountable things. What else, guys? Liquids. Mention liquids as uncountable nouns. What else? Besides uh, water, what else? One bottle. Ah, but one bottle is countable. 
uncountable. So. Uh, when you say one, one bottle of water, you say that is countable because one bottle is countable. But I mean uncountable things, liquids, for example, only water, only water. Uh, yeah, money. Uh -huh, we said we said that money is uncountable. What else Some. is uncountable? Sample sand. Sand from the beach. Beach from the beach. Ah, okay. Sand. Yeah, correct. Sand is uncountable. Uh huh. La arena. Paint. 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 Ah, ah, you mean the the pigments that you use yeah. in paints? Correct. Pigments are uncountable. That's right. Pigments. Uh, let's see what else. Liquids. In general, liquids, orange juice, uh, let's see, soda. Mm -hmm. What else? Mm -hmm. No more. We have we have plain, plenty, plenty of uncountable nouns. Examples. Check. Cheese. Uh huh. Morolique, morolique cheese is uncountable or uncountable? Yeah, I love morolique. Ah, but it's, a, it's delicious, right? A lot of delicious, yes. Cheese is uncountable. What else? No. Love. love. Ah, teacher, but it's love. uncountable. Love is not food. Why love is uncountable? Why? No. Ideas? Why love? Uh huh. Why love is uncountable? Uh, love uncountable. Uh huh. Okay, uncountable nouns are things that you cannot touch. For example, that you cannot see. All right. Love. What else? We have. Next. Water. Butter. Butter, uh huh. Uncountable. Coffee. Coffee. Do you like uh, drinking coffee? You love drinking coffee? Yeah. Uh huh. Delicious. Okay. Delicious. Yes. Soda. Yes, Christina. Ah, soda. All kinds of soda is uncountable. Yes. Uh, what is this? Hunger. What Hunger. 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 What is this hunger is when you do this? Um, so no. When you are when you are angry, angry, angry. Uh -huh. Hi, come on, my brother did this in the house. Uh-huh. Hunger. That is worried. That is worried. Hunger is like <laughs> mm. No, that is hungry. Don't confuse. <laughs> Don't confuse. Hungry, hambriento is. Are you hungry in this moment? Sí. Ah, y el otro es hambre. Aha, uh -huh, hambre. Hungry. hungry. But the hunger, what is hunger? Let's read a definition. The definition, we can see it using the dictionary. Okay, just uh, can you read it? Can you read the definition, please? Definition, can you read it? The feeling you have when you need to eat. Ah, uh, the feeling you have when you need to eat. Ah, uh, but let's see. Hung hunger. Hunger is when you are mad. Huh? Hunger, but this is uh, the feeling when you need to eat. Let's read another one because I remember that is we have another different. Uh, but just give me a moment. I will remember in a few moments. Okay. The next example is next, next after hunger. See you. Fear. What is a fear? What is fear, guys? Miedo. Miedo. Ah, miedo. Uh, do you feel 
fear at night? Do you feel fear at night? I don't. I don't feel fear. I don't. You don't. Ah, okay, you are brave. I don't know. Brave, valiente, right? Okay, good. These ones are examples of uncountable nouns. Okay, got it? Yes? Got it, got it, ¿se entiende? Got it? Yes, you sure. Yes, teacher. All right, okay. We can continue then. Let's see. Uh, grammar quantifiers, let's open the first link. I will click on it. This is like a mini exercise. Let's open it. All right. Let's see, I'm going to select uh, -da -da. Oscar, Oscar, Oscar Guillermo. What is the correct quantifier to complete the sentence? Oscar, Oscar. Hello. Uh, you, okay, are you attentive? Yes, I hear you. Okay, what is the correct quantifier a, B, C, or D to complete this sentence. Hello, teacher. I'm in. There is too, too okay. much traffic. Comma. There is too. There is too ma, much traffic in San Salva. Ah, you say there is much. 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 Okay, let's see. Ah, all right, that is a correct quantifier because traffic is uncountable. Next, uh, let's see, Jorge, Jorge Morales, can you complete this sentence with the correct quantifier? Okay. Uh, can you bring soda to the picnic? I don't have. Mm, I think... <laughs> okay. No, many. Thing, okay, let me help you a little bit. When I don't have it, many. Many, um, perdón. Many, many. Sí. Many. Uh, many. Um, no. Okay. Guys, read when you when you read sentences, check. Affirmative or negative? No. Mm, it's negative. Negative. Correct. negative. Correct. Remember the class from yesterday, from last night. For negative, I don't have any. any. Ah, any. All right. I don't have any. 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 Okay. What is any is quantifier or no? Yeah. No. No. Let's check. No. Any. It says uh. determiner. Or pronoun. Aha, uh -huh, but yes, we can use it. This works as a quantifier in negative sentences. That is correct. Check. Can you bring soda to the picnic? Do you see soda in the picnic? Do you see any soda? Or some soda? I see coffee in the picture. I see coffee. Uh, what is this? Honey. Uh, uh -huh, that is honey, correct. But soda, I don't have. Uh, I don't have. Any. Any. Okay. For negative, yes. For quantifiers, yes. Next picture, uh, uh, let's see, Guillermo. Can you complete this sentence with the correct quantifier? Okay, teacher. How do you feel about your new job? Do you have a, a lot of a lot of responsibilities as as you use it too? Okay, a um, lot. Say a lot. Yeah. Right. Okay. Let's uh, let's. I'm gonna take a screenshot just in case that is incorrect. Let's see. Oh no. Many. It's, Many. Why many? Why is many the quantifier? Mucho. Mucho. Okay, let's read. How may how how do you feel? Can you read it again, please? How do you feel about your new job? 
do you have as many uh, a lot of responsibility as you yourself to? Okay, but only one quantifier, only one. A lot. Uh, it wasn't a lot. No, it was a lot. Just... It was many. 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 Why many? The question is why many is the correct quantifier. Because the word responsibilities is countable or uncountable. Are countable. It's countable. Yeah. countable. Ah, let's check. Responsibility. Countable or uncountable? Let's check. Let's check. Uncountable. It, it says noun. Ah, check, check. Check this. Letter C. What does it mean, letter C? What does it mean? Countable or uncountable? It can be both. Well said, Ambrose. Yeah. It can be both. Can be countable both. or uncountable can be both. That's why in the exercise it was many. Do you have do you have much or many responsibilities in your job? What is correct? Do you have many. much or many? Many. 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 Uh -huh. Do you have many responsibilities? What can I use? Many. Many, correct. Many. Yes, the correct is many. Let's check uh, the next one, this one. Are there? Are there computers in the library? Uh, what is the noun in the sentence? What is the noun? Um, what do we talk about? Computers. Uh, correct, yes. We talk about computers. Are there any? some computers in the library? Are there some or ah okay some or any? Any. any. Some. 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 Uh, some. okay. Okay. I will click on some. Let's see what happens. No. The A lot. is any because that is any. Questions. Any is for questions. Remember, any is for negative and questions. What about this next picture? Can you complete the sentence? Maybe, uh -huh. there maybe are Erica. There are uh -huh. some. There are some people at the top. Some people at the bus. Ah, okay. Some. Are you sure that is some? Yes. Al yes. Algunos. Correct. You don't know the quantity. Some is for not a specific number. Remember. Some. Yes. Algunos. Uh -huh. That is right. That is correct. Pretty good. Pretty good. A nice watch. That is a nice smart watch. Great. Okay, and this one, complete it, please. Anna Cristina, it was some, it was some in the previous. That's right. What about this one? Much. All right, go ahead, read it, read it. You can participate. No we need to hurry, we don't have much time left. We need to hurry, we need to, uh -huh. we need to hurry. We don't have much. Yes, it's much, right? Yes. Much time left. Okay, let's check. Ah, that is correct. Okay, because time, the, the noun time is uncountable. Yes, time is uncountable. That's right. Next, uh, let's see, uh, maybe Erika or Susana. Very uh, a little people. No, no, right. No. Which one? Um, some, some, some very people, very some people. Very, very some people. Does it sound good? Suena bien? 
very mm -hmm. very some people no very few very few what is few poco poco gente a está actualmente feliz con su salario ah that's right yes. <laughs> uh, we are we are talking about salaries or we are talking about people that are not happy. What is the what is the 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 noun in the sentence? People. People, people, people. correct. Not salaries. We are we don't talk about salaries. We talk about people who don't like their oh, salaries. People. That's right. Few in this case is correct. Very few people. Muy pocas. Personas. Next. Have you, you can read it, no problem. Have you go anything to read? Yes, I, I have. Uh -huh. Check the picture. A lot. A lot. A lot. A lot magazine. Uh, okay. Have you got, have you got is is like from British, British English. That is like, do you have in, in American English? Have you got anything to read? Yes. Yes, I had a lot of magazine. I have a lot. A lot magazine. A lot of magazines. Mm. Really? Sure. Um, muchas, muchas revistas. Uh, ah, okay. okay. Yeah, because you are seeing the magazines in the picture. But let's see what happens. ¿Qué pasa? Let her see. Eh, no. Oh, no. It a was few. a few. Hey, why, teacher? Explain, please. Explain why. Okay. When you use a lot, there is another word that goes after lot that is of. A lot of? A lot of work. A lot but, of passing. A okay, lot of, correct. But we have an off. Of, 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 of. No teníamos off in this part. That's why it was incorrect. Okay. Be careful with that. A no, lot. A lot. Of. Of. In that case, yes. We of. are going to check more about the quantifiers. Don't worry. I have a document to show you. I'm going to send it to you. Next, next. Did you? Did you like my present? Yes, I use it a lot. Okay. No. I use it? A lot. A lot, you said a lot. Okay, lo uso. Much, a lot of, a lot, or lots. Mm -hmm. Okay, opinions, opinions. A, B, C, or D. B. B, a lot. Uh, okay, let's see. Ta -da -da -da. A lot of. Yes, it's a lot. Uh -huh. It wasn't a lot of. It was a lot. Okay, what is a lot? What is a lot? I, I don't know what it's the meaning. Ah, the meaning is mucho. In mucho. much? Much is mucho también. Uh huh. Okay, what is the thing? ¿Qué pasa? What is the thing? La cosa es. The thing is that we have to check the noun. If it's countable or uncountable. Oh, check, okay, perfect. Check the noun. Check the noun. What is the noun? Just to understand, teacher, I can use a lot when the the object is countable. If it's if, if not a countable, I can use a lot of... That's correct. Uh, depends, depending, right? But we are okay. gonna check. Don't worry. Don't don't hurry. We are just practicing, just for you to have the idea. But okay. the document it will be better for the explanation. Okay. But let's finish this one. Uh, number number ten. 
A fries. Mm -hmm. Can you read it? Read, read, please. Read it. Make, Mike. Uh, chips. He was ah, those are chips. Leader. That's right. Mike ate. Mike ate. A Many. 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 Many chips. Mm. He wasn't a very hungry. How about read the compliment? Read the compliment. <laughs> He wasn't very hungry. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. He, he didn't want to eat a lot. Okay. No. So, what is the quantifier? A little. A little. A little. A little. Oh, okay. Let's take a little. Ah, no. It was a few. It was a few. Because uh, fries or chips are, mm -hmm. what is chips? Countable or uncountable? Uncountable. Chips. Let's check. Plural noun, potato chips. That means that is a noun. Uh, but it doesn't appear if it's countable. It's countable now. Uh -huh. But remember, remember the exercise? What was the mm -hmm. correct one? A few. A few. A few, one chip, two chips, uh -huh. three chips is countable, a few. Okay. okay, nice, nice. Let's advance. We have a second exercise but you can do it in your house. Don't worry. We are going to check this document that I tell you. It's pretty useful. The document is in this, in this part. Check. It says quantifiers. Let's open it. There it is. Ahí está. Quantifiers. Okay. Uh, help me, please, with the reading, JC, in this part. Quantifiers with countable, uncountable nouns. We use quantifiers before nouns when we want to give information about the number or amount of something. Study the table below. Ah, what does it say? ¿Qué dice? Study the table below. Without reading, without studying, is more difficult. It's better to study or practice before. Okay, the next one, uh, it says, let's see, Javier. Javier, Javier, next. Hmm? Bien. Use with. Use, use with. Usar con, for example, we have, continue. Countable and uncountable nouns. Okay. We use the next quantifiers if you have countable and uncountable nouns. What are those quantifiers? Examples? All. Oh. Enough. Enough. Any, any, enough. Enough. A lot of. A lot of. Lots of. Lots of. More. More. Most. Uh -huh. No. 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 Some. In some. Okay. It says, dice, use with, usar con, countable and uncountable nouns, if you have these ones. Check. You can use all with countable and uncountable. Right? All of these ones. Todos estos. Uh, continue, please, at the reading, please. Let's see, uh, Carmen, Carmen, Carmen. 
Okay. Uh -huh. This part. Informal. Uh, Informal. Plenty of. Uh -huh. Plenty. Plenty of. Heaps of. Heaps of. A load of. A load of. Uh, load of. Loads of. Tons of. Tons of. Etc. Okay. Continue. We have. We have loads of money to spend at this restaurant. Okay, like that. Okay, until that point. But this is the same as a lot of. Es lo mismo que. Money. Uh -huh. A lot of is the same. You can use this one or you can use this one. Okay, but this one is informal. Loads, loads of money. That is an informal, an informal what? An informal? Quantifier. Quantifier. You can use them. Pueden usarlos, yes. No problem. Thank you. Okay, what, who's next? Connie, next please. No. 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 None of the boys called speaks English. Okay, what is known of? Okay, is known of? No. Ninguno. Aha, ninguno, in negative, correct. Yeah. None of the boys who is speak English. Uh, be patient. We be have uh, be patient. Be patient. We have lots of time. We have lots. Lots of time. Uh -huh. It doesn't say a lot of. No, it says a lot of. Why not? Because lots of lots is, of. is informal. Informal. Informal what? A quantifier. Quantifiers. You can use informal quantifiers. No problem. But in speaking. All right, in speaking. Let's okay. see. Continue, please, uh, with the next part. Uh, ta -da -da -da. It, uh, Susana. Use with. Use with countable nouns only. Ah, countable nouns only. Usar solo con. Contable. Contable, Contable. Okay. Mm -hmm. Examples. But both. What is both? Ambos. Uh -huh. uh, for example, girls and boys. All right. Next. Okay. Each. 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 Uh, each. What is each? What is the meaning of each? Cada. Cada one. Cada. Correct. Right. Cada. Next. Either. Either. Uh, either, either, what either. is either? What is either? Cualquiera. Ninguno. Uh, cualquiera can be. Puede ser cualquiera. But we can say. O oh, esta Ninguno. o aquel. Uh -huh. Okay. O esta o aquella. You can choose, for example, talking about shirts. Hablando de shirts, camisas. Uh, which one? Si le pregunto en a... Uh, for example, in Sara, you know Sara, right? The store, Sara. Yeah, the shopping store, you know it? Sara, yes. and Bear, Sarah. those ones. Which shirt do you want? Cualquiera, which shirt do you want? You can, you can buy either the blue one Or the uh, red one. Check. Usted puede comprar. Uh -huh. Puede comprar. Either. 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 La azul. O. Uh -huh. Hola. 
after the blue or the roja. Or the red. Ajá. Or the yes. red one. The red one. Cualquiera. Either is cualquiera. You can buy either the blue one or the red one in the store. Okay, it's like an option, but you can check. Um, you can buy you can buy the blue or the red one, but only one because it's it's an option. Okay, let's see uh, next. A number of. A number of un numero de example. Ah, uh, we have few. Few. Next. Few. A few. A few. What a is few. few? What is few? Algunos. In uh, what is few? Um, pocos. With the article. Con el artículo. With the article. I don't know. Unos. O algunos. Unos. Unos pocos. Unos pocos. Algo no. Unos pocos, yes. Because the quantifier is... Pocos. Cuando le ponemos el, art, el artículo, se convierte en... Unos pocos. Unos sí. pocos. Yes. Ok. No article, pocos. Y para... No article, y, unos say pocos. Un poquito es a little bit. That's ok. A little bit. Ah, ok. But a little bit is for on conto. We are going to check if a little bit appears in this table. Si aparece <laughs> en la tabla. Next. Fewer and neither. And neither. All these ones are quantifiers. Todos estos son quantifiers. Fewer. What does it mean fewer, teacher? Fewer, uh, unos pocos, I guess. Creo oh, okay. que también ese. A fewer. Let's see. Okay. Uh, let's check the tool. Revisemos. Few. Fewer. Determiner. Uh -huh, a few appears is similar to a few, muy similar a few. Let's see if appears in this one. And of you were done. I tried to contact him, no fewer than 10 times. Ah, okay. It's like contable with, un con with contable nouns. Traté de contactarlo a él, no. Tantas veces. Mm -hmm. Como hasta 10. It says in the, in the examples, yes. No fewer than. No tantas veces de 10, for example. No fewer than. Okay, it's like no tantas. No tantas veces in, in this example. Uh, let's go back with the, let's see, with the document. Uh, in, let's see. Informal, do we have informal? Yes. Informal? A couple of. A couple of. A couple of. Hundred of. Hundreds of. Hundreds of. Hmm? Thousands of millions. Thousands of. of. Miles de. Miles de. Millions. Millions of. Millions of. Those are informal, but you can use them with. With contable nouns. Contable only. Nouns. Solo con contable nouns. Examples. There were very few burglars at the party. There were very few. Estaban. Mm -hmm. Muy pocas chicas en la fiesta. Ah, muy pocas. Very few. Muy. Very, muy. Pocas, few. Next. You had a couple of minutes to finish the exercise. Oh, really? No, we had 10 minutes. Not a couple. Okay. A couple of. What is a couple of? What is a couple of? Mm. A couple of hours, a, po a couple de. of minutes. Or just solo un par de. All right. A, 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 couple, a couple of bird. Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That is one example. Yes, uh -huh. it's a one example. 
you have just a couple of beers to see only. Solo para ver, right? Not to Which drink. On the next weekend. Ah, on the weekend. Okay, good. Next example. That's laptop costs hundred for dollars. Hundreds of dollars. Is a laptop cuesta? Mm -hmm. Hundreds, cientos, correct. Hundreds of dollars. Okay, pretty good, pretty good. Let's see, I continue with the next part. Gilbert, Gilbert, Gilbert. Use, uh, use with. Use with uncountable nouns only. Uncountable nouns only. Let's see. Oh, here it is. Aquí está, eh? A little, a little, little much, a bit of, an amount of. That's it. Informal. In the informal quantifiers. A great deal of, a good deal of. Example. We don't, we don't have much time left. All right. You'll be in a great deal of. Trouble, trouble if you don't finish to work. What is the meaning of the sentence in this part? You'll be in a great deal of trouble if you don't finish your work. Mm -hmm. You'll be in a great deal of trouble. It's like, yeah. usted va, va a estar en un gran Problema. Problema. Aha. Trouble. Trouble is countable or uncountable? Uncountable. Problem. Uncountable. Aha. Problem. Right? A big trouble. Big issue. It's a noun. Si es un noun. But let's check. Ah. Countable or uncountable. It can be both. De que va a depender si es contable o uncountable. It depends on the context, del contexto de lo que se diga ahí. Ajá. De eso va a depender. Ok. Ah, pero no. Next, next, next. Example. The criminal. The criminal has a large amount of cash on him. On him. A large amount of. What is a large amount of a large a lot una of gran cantidad. una gran cantidad de Correct. dinero con él right. un dineral in spanish right in <laughs> english <laughs> un dineral se dice así a large amount of cuando quiera decir eh hey, mi amigo tiene un dineral ahora que se fue a los us en inglés como dice how do you my, say? My friend have a lot of a lot of money with uh, him. Ah, uh, my friend, but check. What is the quantifier? A large amount of cash. Ah, uh, my friend has a large cash. A large cash amount. A large cash. Amount of cash. A large. Amount of, of cash. 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 Now he is at the US. In Los US, USA. Oh, that is always kind of true, right? Más o menos cierto. Okay, very good. But those ones are only with uncountable. Solo con uncountable. A little, less, much, etc. Teacher, there, they are too many, so demasiados. Yes, I know, but with the practice, check. Things to remember, para que recuerden. Things to remember, you can read them, pueden leerlas. And below, you have practice. You have practice. Complete the sentences with any, lots of, a bit of, a little, etc. That is practice for you. 
Let's see what else. General versus specific groups. A study how we use the quantifiers. Few, a few, both, all, many, etc. And then you have more explanation. All right, groups in general, a specific groups, for example. Read, please. Read, read, read. Check. More exercise. Five minutes. Let's see. Uh, we are going to do the second link. Let's open it in the final last minute with explanation that you receive. Ah, no, this is the same, the same link. Let's check. And I thought it was different. Oh, no, 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 it's not. No, it's different. Okay, no problem, guys. Let's see. Yeah, it is the same. I don't know what happened, but no problem. Okay, in this class, check. You have exercises to do, extra info. I gave us info. Quantifiers, check. More explanation, kind of similar, muy similar. And links that you can use to practice. Let's open uh -huh, a few, a little exercise one. Uh, okay, number one, indication before. Antes la explicación. A few. <clears throat> A few or a little. Choose. Choice, choose the correct answer. The correct answer. Okay, sugar. Few. A few. A few or a little. A few. A little. A little. A little. Ah, okay, sugar. Okay. Sugar countable or uncountable? Uncountable. If you have doubts, check the dictionary. Si tiene dudas, revise el dictionary. Sugar, uh, it's a noun, a countable um, or uncountable. Okay, but it's uncountable. Uh, it's uncountable. For uncountable, we use? Cualquiera de los dos. A few. A few or little. Cualquiera. A few. A little. Uh, we are going to check. Okay, let's check a few. Let's see what happens. Veamos qué pasa si pone a few. Next. A little. Time. Time. A little. A little time or a few time. Mm -hmm. A few time. A few. No. Uh, no, really? a little. A little. A little. Let's little. place a little. Number three. A few. A few. Uh -huh. A few. Let's see. A few, a few, a few. I don't remember. Teacher, a few, a few, a few, a few. Where is a few? Countable or uncountable? Not countable. Uh, a few, a few. Ah, here it is. Aquí está. Countable nouns only. A few. Aquí está a few. Does we do we have a few in this part? Que funcione con contable or uncountable a few in this part? You see it? Lo no. Ve? no, right? So. so a few, a few is only for contable uh, nouns. nouns. In that way you can check. Y así se revisa. Uh -huh. Houses. Yeah. A few. Cheese. A, a little, little cheese. A little a cheese. Little. Un quesito. A little <laughs> cheese. You know, right? Okay. Complete the exercise, guys. Complete the exercise. And at the end, you have the option to check. Let's see. Panoram. Uh, the results. <clears throat> Number one. Incorrect. It was a little sugar. It's a little sugar. What is the meaning? Significado de a little sugar? Like un this. Poco. Un poco, un poco de azúcar. Un poco, correct. 
Okay, a little sugar. No una sucarita, right? Not, <laughs> not talking about Kellogg's. No, we are talking about the quantity. That's why the topic is, por eso el tema es, quantifier. we are talking about quantity, the cantidad. Okay, no the, no the size, no the tamaño. Okay, guys, I will, I will upload the document for you in the Google Drive link. So you can have the document and you have the links to practice before the assignments. Okay, uh, that's it. That was the topic, guys. It's important that you practice, that you review with the links. Okay. Uh, good night. That's it. You are. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. Thank tomorrow. you, guys, for attending the class. Good night. See you tomorrow. Sure. Of course. First, God, see you tomorrow night. Bye bye. Bye, teacher. Good night. Good night. Have a good rest. <laughs>